Here we will show you how to fix the iPad white screen of death problem in detail. Fix 1. Check the zoom feature. Sometimes you might accidentally zoom in on a white object on the screen, which could be mistaken for a frozen white screen. In that situation, try double tapping the iPad screen with three fingers to unfreeze it. Fix 2. Deplete iPad battery. When your iPad screen is white, you might not be able to access it at all. A simple solution is to let the battery drain completely. Once the battery runs out, the screen will go black. At that point, you can connect the charger to your iPad and try restarting it to see if the iPad white screen problem is resolved. Fix 3. Hard reset the iPad. The next way to fix my iPad screen is white is to hard reset your iPad. By simply holding the buttons, you will rapidly fix the problem. For iPad with a home button, press and hold the home plus power button simultaneously for 10 seconds until the Apple logo appears on the screen. It will then restart automatically. After rebooting, check whether the iPad or white screen problem exists. For iPad without a home button, fast press and release the volume up button and then the volume down button. Later, press and hold the power button until the Apple logo shows up. Afterward, it will restart. Most of the time, the iPad Pro white screen of death issue will disappear. Then, fix 4. Apply the 3 button option. You can press and hold the home plus volume up plus power buttons at the same time and wait for a while until the iPad's white screen disappears. After that, you will see the Apple logo on the screen, and your iPad will reboot automatically. Fix 5. Boot the iPad into the recovery mode. Step 1. Connect the iPad to your computer using a USB cable and open iTunes. Step 2. Put your iPad into recovery mode. For an iPad with a home button, press and hold both the power and home buttons for about 10 seconds. Release the power button, but keep holding the home button. Do not release the home button until you see the Apple logo. Continue holding until you see the connect to iTunes icon or a cable pointing to your PC screen. For an iPad without a home button, quickly press and release the volume up button, then the volume down button. Press and hold the power button. Do not release it when the Apple logo appears. Keep holding until you see the connect to iTunes icon or a cable pointing to the PC screen. Step 3. Once iTunes detects your iPad, select Restore. iTunes will install the latest iPados on your iPad and overwrite all the iPad settings and contents. Step 4. After the restoring process, the iPad white screen should disappear. Next, you can set up your iPad and access it. Fix 6. Get the iPad into the DFU mode. This trick resolves the problem by reinstalling the iPados version onto your iPad, which means you will also lose all the iPad content and settings. Step 1. Plug your iPad into the computer, launch iTunes, and put your iPad into DFU mode. Step 2. After your iPad enters DFU mode, iTunes will show a message indicating that it has detected an iPad in recovery mode. Click the OK button to proceed to the next step. Step 3. Once the process is complete, your iPad will reboot as a new device. Fix 7. Using iOS System Recovery Without Data Loss Step 1. After installing iOS System Recovery on your computer, please open it and connect your iPad to the computer via USB cable. Next, enter the iOS System Recovery Mode. Step 2. The software will automatically detect the iPad and show the problem on the screen. After that, click the Start button to continue. Step 3. Confirm the iPad information on the screen. If incorrect, choose the right one from the drop-down list. Once confirmed, tap the repair button to start fixing the iPad white screen of death issue. Fix 8. Contact Apple support. If none of the above methods work, it is recommended to contact Apple support for professional assistance or take the device. Apple's technicians can diagnose hardware issues and perform necessary repairs to ensure the problem is fully resolved. Thank you.